So I've been working on my challenge of creating one music track a day. And uh, don't worry, I'm not gonna bore you by showing every single track uh, every single day that I do for the next um, three weeks. Apparently, the lockdown is gonna go for longer, we don't know yet. But for now, it's just for the next three weeks. This is week one. Uh, I've done my track. And I just want to play it for you very quickly. Don't call me lazy. This is one of those corporate tracks that uh, is the bread and butter of, of our income when it comes down to stock uh, composition, uh, meaning that it's a, it's a corporate track. Uh, the only things that I'm not using here is any live instruments. So the limitations for me is using just the free plugins that come uh, with uh, Logic. And, uh, and that's it, nothing else really. Uh, everything else in here, all of the sounds, everything is uh, stock sounds that come with Logic. And I try to create <laughs> what most will call uh, a corporate, bland or boring track. But you know, I just want to play it for you very quickly so you can see what's possible. What can you create with uh, using just free plugins? And uh, like I said, limitation is not using any live instrument because I wanted to, to push myself. Okay, so this is what it sounds like. The essence of the track is, is something very simple. It's something that I'm thinking about. Yes, a corporate track that's going to work with a presentation or something in the background, uh, meaning that it could be a voiceover, uh, trying to explain something, some kind of training program. So I want something that is really uh, middle of the road, if you will, and uh, to make it exciting for me. In uh, not exciting, I should say, but to be, to be a little bit lazy is to not uh, include any live instruments uh, because I want it to sound. Uh, like this, I want it to sound very corporate. Uh, what most compo composers will think that this is a, a bland music, that it's not something that it has no emotion, it's something that uh, that <laughs> is not what you should be doing. But then again, I want to break that myth that corporate music uh, is nothing more than corporate music. Corporate music is supposed to be corporate music. It's not supposed to be anything else. And it has a purpose of how we use this music and you need to know uh, where this music uh, could be used. And um, if you are a stock composer, you don't do corporate music, that's perfectly fine. Um, but the reason why I do this type of tracks is because they do sell uh, and they can be used in a wide variety of uh, video uh, editing uh, presentations, a slideshow, keynotes presentations, uh, commercials, um, it's, you, you can see this type of music used everywhere and the trick is to make it kind of like pleasant to listen to it okay i mean just because i do this type of music that doesn't mean that i don't enjoy the final result the final product am i going to grab this type of music track and promote my music uh on spotify as an artist doing this type of music most likely not this is aimed for something else so I think for us composers, it's really important to have a dis distinction or to separate what uh, music is uh, for licensing and that it serves a purpose, it's in the service of somebody, somebody else's project and what's artistic and what's uh, non-commercial, quote unquote, when it comes down to promoting ourselves as artists. So if I'm gonna have an artist a profile online, I'm not gonna put this type of music, I will put something different. Uh, but I will use this in my online uh, profile uh, showing uh, what a corporate track will be. And even if I have this on my SoundCloud uh, account, which is as a showcase for what kind of music I can compose uh, for licensing, aiming for licensing, uh, this is what it will be. And I will have something like this uh, in that playlist for sure. So people can see or clients can see uh what i am able to to do okay so it's just a quick video entry today uh, i'm composing different uh tracks as you know in terms of uh different genres and, and whatnot uh and this type of music is really easy i did struggle a lot at the beginning to create this type of music track um because i just didn't know what corporate music is so uh a quick background is that i feel proud of this type of music because uh 
I didn't know how to do it and now I know how to do it very fast and very easily and it's very, uh, it, it comes effortless really to me. And if I grab the guitar, it sounds even more organic and I have uh, a few tracks out there on this YouTube channel actually uh, explaining how to do corporate music. So, but the challenge is for me to do it with the plugins, with the stock plugins, so we do create that kind of like corporate sound and see how much can I, uh, can I push myself to, to really create that corporate brand, that sonic brand that we hear out there. So this is it for today, my corporate track of the day. Remember, one track a day keeps failure away. I hope wherever you are, you're doing well. If you happen to be somebody that is new to music licensing or to royalty-free libraries, download my free guide, link in the description. And as always, rock and roll, and here's to your success.